I like to try to collect as many bamboo pieces as you can because these always come in handy for trellising. And uh, pretty common, a lot of people grow bamboo. Uh, you maybe know someone that has some bamboo at their house and you could get some pieces from them. So this is gonna be supporting my um, tomato plants. Let's take these over. Okay, you can see I just put this tomato in. Tomato plant that just fell over actually. I had, see it almost split right there. I gotta be very careful. I don't damage this. I'm gonna cut out some of these unneeded um, suckers, but you can see here there's three main stems coming out. What I would like to do is do three bamboos um, going in like a triangle form and then train those to grow up straight up the bamboo in like a triangle shape so then we'll prune out these suckers you can see right here this is a that's that right there's a sucker going up that needs to be trimmed off otherwise we have two stems I don't want to have too many main stems so three is pretty much maxed maxed out so first let's I'll do a little pruning and then we'll put these stakes in. Now you can see right here, I just got I got my bamboo, just setting them on the ground, kind of getting them laid out. Now I want to create a triangle, but they're all going to go straight up though. So they're going to have three places to tie off, three branches, three main stems, so three bamboo. So it also, I'm not going to go too close to the stem because remember I just transplanted this and the roots go all the way to here. So I don't want to puncture too close to all those roots and damage all those roots. So I'm staying outside of my transplant uh, pot zone, which is, I had a five gallon smart pot. So if you make a circle, it goes like this, kind of going around. So I want to clear that. This one I can go a little closer. So I got equal spacing all the way around here. I'm gonna put one right. This will be a good spot, so. So I'm just gonna push this in. About 16 inches. Let's go ahead and push this one in. Just to make sure it's solid. You can go farther, two feet if you need to. I have really soft dirt here. So go straight in. 16. I want these sturdy. You got to go 24. And then just go ahead and kind of pack the dirt like this around it. Make sure they're sitting up straight. Okay, so these are going up about seven feet. You can see one, two, three. And now what I'll do is I'll take some twine, some string, and as these grow, you can see here, This will allow you to grow straight up. So I'm kind of guiding them. You can see I'll put a twine right around here. Okay, just about done with this now. Look at this, it's looking good. I went ahead and tied everything up here. Just some regular uh, square knots, I guess you call it. Make sure this isn't gonna slide off. So you don't wanna yank on it too hard. I could probably slide that down a little bit. So now this will just go straight up. This, as this grows, will go straight up as well. Quick and easy trellis for huge, growing huge tomato plants. Okay, everybody get out there and plant some tomatoes and get your trellises up. Make sure you subscribe and 
Comment below, tell me what type of uh, trellises you guys are using. We'll see you guys next time. Hit that subscribe button, click like, and we'll see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.